tutorial, I will be talking about a very, very easy buttercream made with condensed milk. If you like this type of tutorial, feel free to subscribe to my channel. All links will be posted in the comment box below. This recipe is super easy. It only requires four ingredients. You will need condensed milk, vegetable shortening, vanilla extract, and butter. You will need one cup of butter, that's two sticks of butter. You want them at room temperature and you want to cream them well. You will need to add half a cup of vegetable shortening to this mix and cream everything really well. The vegetable shortening is very important as it gives stability to the recipe. Once you have your butter and your vegetable shortening cream, you can add your condensed milk. The condensed milk needs to be cold. This is very important. Once you add it, you want to mix this well in a medium setting. Do not over mix because then you will create a lot of bubbles. At this point, you can add any flavoring. I usually add clear vanilla or you can use a vanilla bean. This is the perfect consistency of your buttercream. I am going to over mix this to show you what will happen if you over mix. And I will show you how it will look and how you can fix it. As I move the mixture around, you can see it looks dry. It has a lot of holes in it. This is not really how you want it to look. You want it to be smooth. You can still ice your cake with it like that, but you can see you will get a lot of bubbles as you try to smooth it out. You can boil some water and use your scraper, hot but dry, to try and smooth everything out, and it works well. But you can also fix your mixture. I just take the mixture and put it in the microwave for 10 seconds increments until I get it to be smooth just like this. This is how it looks after I put it in the microwave a few times for 10 seconds. It will be a bit softer so you can put this in the fridge to chill a little bit and then you can use to pipe and to decorate your cake. When the mixture is well mixed you'll have very smooth buttercream. You can see the original mixture in my cake because I left it just as it was before but you can see the shells and that's after I fixed it. You see they are smooth and they pipe really beautiful. You can see in here how beautiful this buttercream pipes. It's very easy to make. The only down part to it, it does need to be refrigerated. It is really delicious, it's fast to make and you can cover your cakes nicely. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, share your work with me in Facebook, visit me in Instagram, and until next time, ta-ta!